I dated a great guy for a long time. We were great friends at first. And then gradually a serious relationship developed between us, which was on its way to marriage. Judy says, I am 28 years old. He is 30 years old. He was a programmer, wanted a family, and was a bit too domestic. Beautifully courted, drove to work, and met from work. At the same time, I had a flirtation that didn't require anything. I happened to have a correspondence with an elderly and long married boss who was 40 years old. We started joking about close relationships, lovers and so on. I didn't pay much attention to it. It was just an excuse for me to distract myself from the boredom of work. Then suddenly it was urgent to go with him on business out of town. The thought flashed through my mind that we had started a relationship, but I thought it was just my fantasy. He doesn't look like a man who would cheat on his wife with a subordinate too low for him. On the way back, he suddenly stopped the car on the side of the road, turned around and said, We've obviously forgotten something. And passion erupted between us. For the first few seconds, I was scared. But then I just let my feelings come out. We took off, or should I say ripped off each other's clothes. I like the man. He likes me. Why not? On top of that, I figured it would only be a one-time thing. After everything that had happened between us, it was so strange to drive back pretending like nothing had happened. We went back to the office. After an hour my fiancé picked me up from work, we went for a walk, had dinner, and then we had a very stormy night of love. In the morning I woke up in my fiancé's apartment, had breakfast, he took me to work. Somewhere around lunchtime, I realized that I had done a very bad thing and called myself all sorts of bad words. That I was on the same day with two men at once. To distract myself, I decided to take it easy after work and went shopping. My fiancé realized from the messages that I wasn't feeling well. He arrived, we walked around the mall. I decided to tell him everything. I confessed everything. He listened to me. He said he expected something like this, that I wasn't the kind of person to build a serious relationship with, and that I'd broken his heart. He drove me home, and we never spoke again. I tried to talk to him. I told him that this relationship was only once. It was just an accident that will never happen again. I'll be faithful to you. Don't be afraid. You'll be my only man. But he just ignored my words, pretending he didn't know me. My boss turned out to be just as much of a jerk as my ex-boyfriend. He too dumped me, ignored me, and stopped texting me. I found out that I wasn't the only one he slept with on the staff. So I decided to get back at him by telling my wife. But my wife told me back. I know he's cheating on me. He cheats on me and then comes back to me. After talking to my boss's wife, I was fired. Now I'm alone, abandoned by everyone and without a job.